the golden turd made that tree's mouth fall agape. And I am, if I am not mistaken, this is our last level. Which should put us at 50 treasures, really? So you only need 49 treasures to finish this game. And I just hecked up by getting that car. Wow, this game has a has a pretty low clear percentage then, eh? Cause I am I am fairly certain that And you'll also notice that then in in the in the full clear you do you are required to get uh, all the treasures in just this one level. I don't think any other level we get all four treasure chests. I have so screwed the pooch on this one, guys. I don't know how I'm this bad at video games. I don't know how I'm this bad at video games and then like decide, hey, I probably should should like play video games online and show people. <laughs> okay, bird. Now this is the one where we gotta jump on these birds. And you'll also notice we're gonna have to be climbing this thing like twice. Once after once after we get the donut power up to break through it. Yow. Bird please again. Can I not have bird please again? There we go. Donut me, bro. Please, please, donut me. Alright, donut me on this side. Once more. I wish that I could just, like, wave my donut wand and get donut. Oh no, we're gonna have to do this... ...a bunch of times if... No, I pressed one too many on the first one. God damn it. Yep. I'm I am actually curious to see what my overall time doing the playing Wario Land 3 here is going to be. Because we're just pushing two hours here. My first recording session was one and a half hours. That's that's close to three hours just to beat the game. I wonder if I could talk talk people in for a Wario Land three race. Although you know, there's not a lot of difference in the race. There it would just be you know, let's get together and beat Wario Land three as a community. What did I get down at the bottom? I opened up... I opened up something on the bottom. I immediately... Like, I was just... Because I see that blue key there, and I'm like, wait, I need the blue key. I did not need to be turned into string. What the heck did I do that donut bit for? There. I have ways of dealing with you. And you too. Haha! -ha! Oh, now this is gonna spit me on the outside of the. Oh, and I knocked that bird down. Spit me on the outside of the uh, creepy tree. Okay, what was I doing down here? What was. It was just for a coin or something, wasn't it? God damn it. Zoning out, looking at what my time was. Oh, don't fall down. Oh. You know. It just wouldn't be a let's play that I do without kind of falling apart at the end here. Why is why like the game isn't Oh my god, really? This this is this is how we do it. The game isn't appreciably more difficult than it was, you know, I almost said four hours ago. We just figured out that I've only been at this for three and a half hours. It is not appreciably more difficult. Uh it's just that I am worse. I have I have been gotten worse. Also, seriously, like this Xbox controller is cramping up not just my thumb but my arm, and I'm not a not a fan of that. Please and thank you. Now that I have these donut holes missing, it's actually making uh, some of these timing on the birds worse. Also, don't make me fat, bro. I do, do not need the fat warrior power up. 
Okay, so we got the key on the outside. This is our now, like, 14th time climbing it. No birds to be dealing to, to be dealing with. God damn it! There you are. And we're in for the last boss. I really like the look of this boss. Okay, what are you doing? So grab the string. If now, ooh woo, ooh woo. What's this? Uh, if the string hits you, it does turn you into String Wario, and then you go flying out the side of the, the tree there. So don't let that happen. Just let the string glide effortlessly down. Oh, damn it. I jumped into him instead of pressing B to go up. Please don't chase me, string. Just, 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 just chill. There we go. Yeah, that was not so bad. Hey. Um. Yo, spider. D damn it! I swear I'd press down on that spider. How far down are you gonna make me fall? Not that far. Not terrible. Not the worst thing that's happened to me. They kind of prepare you for the whole uh, string gimmick. Also, that was last boss causing the actual damage, if, if you hadn't noticed. There you go. String, do your worst. Now, the falling string doesn't get me as bad as that one hammer, or was it the hammer guys? The spiky ball. Let's do your thing, string. We got all day. Man, my timing is, is is poor on that. Come on. Slam down. Ow, ow, ow. Hey, I would really like to not be... Why is that not... Okay, so you gotta be right on his back to be able to get that. I was just having a bad time at it. Yo, please no, please no. Damn it, damn it, damn it. You could see how I kind of got trapped there through absolutely no fault of my own. <sighs> Third time's a charm. Third time's a charm, right? Third try strats. And this is, this is not even the worst boss in the game. There is a game, or th there is a game, there is a boss, and oh, god damn it. There is a boss, and it is way worse than this. And it is yet to come. It is, of course, the final boss. For its kind of bullshittery. Ow. Hey, but please also don't do that. I can't remember what the reset time is on the final boss, but it's, uh, it's no fun. But I'll talk about the final boss when we get there. Final boss also has something kind of unique about it that I will, uh, I will get to. Please to not be bouncing on my head. Hey, 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 what's with the bouncing like that? And it's not like I'm j I'm trying to jump or get out of that in a very weird way. Okay. Stay. What like what the heck are you supposed to do when when um the string ball chases you like that? No. There you are. There you are, you stinky thing. See, third time's the charm. And these guys don't turn you into string. This is gonna be the last music box, and I'm pretty darn sure this is my favorite music box. Or we've already missed what my favorite music box is. Please be the one. Yes, this is my favorite. It's got the little jumping snowmen. Look at them, they're so cute. They've got the little hats that bounce.
And then it's like, as if you didn't know you're supposed to go to the temple. Nothing changes on the overworld, but it's like, hey, hey, this is your chance. Okay, so, that is all of our treasures. We do have 50, and I have the one extraneous one, which was... Yeah, this. Is the goblet extra as well? I don't remember. Anyways, let's go in and talk to the temple. A hidden figure. Wonderful work, Wario. Now, replenish my power. Alright, creepy hidden wall thing. What is it about these handheld games and, like, collecting musical instruments or music boxes and then getting them to all sync up at the end? There's, like, this, and there's Link to the Past, and I'm sure there's... Or, sorry, um, Link's Awakening, and I'm sure there are other examples. Oh, yeah, the temple's falling apart right now because his power is un unleashed, and that can only be a good thing, right? Now he's gonna give us all our treasure and just slap us on the butt and tell us to go away. Yeah, that's not hideous or nightmare-inducing. A hidden figure, who is no longer hidden. <laughs> Finally, I'm, I'm myself again. Now, I can rule this world, and the outer one as well. I need you no longer, Wario. I shall crush you like a bug. If I get this first try, I will not be showing off the, the, the cool part about this boss, in that this is the only way you can get a game over screen. Oop in this game is if the boss... Well, okay, so I didn't get it first try. The boss with his hideous red sharp teeth grabs you, it saves, and you get a game over screen. <laughs> you cannot die any other way than on the very last boss of the game. And it just shits out back to the uh, title screen. It's like, yep, screw you. But no. You can skip this by pressing start. Okay, now we're in serious concentration mode as I try and... Yep, dodge that, please and thank you. I think you have to be doing a down... or a ground pound. To be able to grab this. And unfortunately, this boss does not follow the rule of... Ooh, I got two off on him there. I don't think I've ever done that. Holy crap. Yips. Can I... I just... This boss does not follow the rule of threes, as I was saying, but I think he does go down on the... F oh, god damn it. On the fourth one. Somehow I skipped a whole phase of this fight that I normally have trouble with. Somehow this is going poorly and also really well. I am seeing the code. I have the matrix in me. That was it. I did it. Holy crap. Second try. I got a lucky second hit there. Or I mean third hit, but wow. Oh, man. <laughs> An ending to an LP that actually goes well? Yeah, so he has four. You got to hit him four times. What video game boss do you have to hit four times to beat? Oh, and, uh, spoiler alert, all those enemies in the game that we were, uh, that we were, um, just butt-pounding and running into and killing, uh, the reason that they didn't kill us, uh, only just, you know, do mildly inconvenient things to us was because they were, they were people and, uh, and not enemies, and this Dragon Quest-looking motherfucker here is about to explain what was up with that. Old man, thank you very much. Long ago, this was a peaceful world. But, that meddlesome being appeared, and tried to take control. We managed to seal away his power in the five music boxes, but he used the last of his power to change us into strange beings. Fearing his return, we tried to stop you, but we never thought you would defeat him. Thank you very much. So, we give you all the treasure you have collected so far. Now then, let me send you back to your own world. 
Please don't come back into our music box and ransack it for another 50 treasures. Uh, we kind of want to keep those. Also, get the fuck out of our cave. For some reason, I have a sword and like a little bobble there, which I never collected. And we didn't have to do any more, uh, any more, um, golf. It was just the couple ones right up at front. So my, uh, my collecting coins were for naught. And we get a nice little music box remix here at the end as the end credits. Wario Land 3, Staff. I want more Wario Land games, damn it! That was fun! And we only saw half the game! Go and play the other half yourself, you lazy bastards! This is fun! I'm enjoying this! I don't have really much more to say here, just let the credits roll. I just always find it's important to let credits roll during uh, an LP. You know, otherwise you're kind of cheaped out. Some of my- the other- the other highlight, uh, Wario- or I guess really one of the only other Wario Land games that I've- have extensive, uh, experience with is the Wario Land- or Wario Master of Disguise on the Nintendo DS. And if I can ever figure out a good way to, uh, to record that, you might see that here in the future. Now, I'm going to plug Couch Cave and tell them to get on doing their Wario Land 4, LP that, that uh, Brady says is absolutely for sure happening and I'm not allowed to do a Wario Land 4 LP until they get theirs underway so I don't snipe that from them. So here's here's your call, man. Get on it. And I know what you're going to say to me. Well, you should go back and do the other, you know, 50 treasures first if you want more Wario on your channel. I'm like, oh, oh, oh. maybe I will. But I want to do something else in the meantime. I've got something up my sleeve, but you guys will just have to wait and see what that is. Is there a... Uh, does it shunt me back to the title screen? Or do we just get to sit on this? Is this one of those end screens that just stays this way? I'm going to say this is one of them end screens that just stays this way. Well, thanks so much, guys. This has been a fun LP. I will see you uh, on the flip side. Bye! Bye!